It's the Past Live show for March 11th, and I'm your host, Jim Polizzi. We're going to explore everything cool musically that happened on March 11th or relating to March 11th, and it's all going to be live. That's why we call it the Past Live show. We're going to start off with an artist whose album started a historic run on the UK charts today in 1978. Here's some meatloaf from November 1977. Good evening. Coming to you tonight from my father's place in the village of Old Roslyn. I'm Dennis McNamara. Would you please give a warm welcome at WLIRFM to meet Lowe. And wherever you are, wherever you go, it's always 
in Old Roslyn, New York. Meatloaf performing the title track of his debut album, Bad Out of Hell. And that album hit the charts in 
the UK today in 1978 and stayed there for an amazing 416 weeks, never hitting number one, only getting as high as number nine. It was on the charts for 83 weeks in the US and only made it to number three, 13 in the US. The album has sold over 43 million copies worldwide. Now we move on to something else. It's Crosby, Stills, Nash & Young, whose debut album, Deja Vu, was released today, March 11, 1970.
I just bought it a while ago from uh, these two lawyers. And uh, there was an old man living on it. I don't know if you have the things like that here, like uh, foreman on ranches. It's like an old caretaker who takes care of all the cows, fences and everything. So I wrote this song for him. Old man, look at my life I'm a lot like you were Old man, look at my life I'm a lot like you were Old man, look at my life Twenty-four and there's so much more Live alone in a paradise That makes me think of two Love lost such a cost Give me things that don't get lost Like a coin that won't get tossed Rolling home to you my life I'm a lot like you I need someone to love me the whole day through I want to look in my eyes and you can tell that's true Lullabies, look in your eyes Run around the same old town Doesn't mean that much to me To mean that much to you I've been first and last Look at how the time goes past But I'm all alone at last Rolling home Oh, that's a little better 
standing in the airport I am getting off a plane Glad to be in London Even though it's pouring rain It's the right time of year All the leaves are autumn brown But I really only want to get to you It's a bright sunny day When I see you run my way But it took me 20 years to get to you Oh, that's a little better 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 I'm going to leave you with a song called If You Don't Love Me, I'll Kill Myself. Droge here on the Past Lives Podcast. We heard four songs in that set, and I'm going to tie them all back to Crosby, Stills, Nash, and Young somehow. 
We started off the set with Crosby, Stills, Nash & Young, performing at the Fillmore East in New York City, June 6, 1970, and the album, Deja Vu, their first album together, was released March 11, 1970. We also heard some music from Neil Young performing at the BBC on the In Concert TV show on February 23, 1971, and of course, he easily ties into the theme here. Uh, that was Old Man, and the album Harvest was released on March 11, 1972. Then we heard some music from Roger McGuinn, who, of course, was once a member of the Birds, a band that once had David Crosby in it. And that track was called Get To You. It was from the Performing Arts Center in Cambridge, Massachusetts, and that was on March 11, 1974. And we just heard some music from Pete Droge, If You Don't Love Me, I'll Kill Myself. Pete Droge, who thankfully is still with us, is celebrating a birthday today. He was born March 11, 1969. And that was from the Bridge Benefit, a concert put on by Peggy Young, Neil Young's wife, to benefit the school for special needs kids that she started. If you like what you hear on this podcast, send me a like, send me a comment, and subscribe if you will. And we're going to move right along with the music and hear some of the amazing vocal talents of Bobby McFerrin, born March 11th, 1950. <laughs> Can we have the lights turned down just a bit? Blue would be nice. Mm-hmm. 
Music of the Dixie Hummingbirds recorded March 11th, 1979 at Avery Fisher Hall in New York City, doing the song they helped Paul Simon out with, Love Me Like a Rock. And before that, we heard the amazing vocal improvisations of Bobby McFerrin, recorded at the Great American Music Hall in San Francisco, June 17th, 1983. And Bobby McFerrin was born March 11th, 1950. So he is celebrating... Uh, 74 years today. We just heard some music from June 17, 1983. Let's go back to June 17, 1975 and celebrate an album that was released today, March 11, 1975 by Alice Cooper. It's the title track to Welcome to My Nightmare. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Is anybody out there? In the midst of his most fantastic tour ever, your own hometown boy, let's hear it, the incredible, the legendary, Alice Cooper! Sweating, laughing, screaming 
far you come This is how far you gone This cruise Luna Sirens to the loud Streets of meat Too many floors Blow the belt you know This is how far you come This is how far you gone You gone, let's who's who now Make a mission My love is coming Not too soon I'm bent to sail out of the blue My love is coming I'm dead through Who's a bread and romance is spinning
stone will stop the dust of time His hands strike a flame of his soul Ties a rope to a tree and hangs the universe To the wind of laughter blows cold It's hideous head Dread Death in the wind Man of steel, brand new With fever's blazing torch Thrust into the face of the night Cause a blade of compassion Kissed by countless kings Your trumpet words blind his sight Wars that no man thought would fall The altars of the just Crush Just in the wind No man knew to fly to my ship
live show for March 11th. We ended the show with some music from Emerson, Lake, and Palmer from the Anaheim Convention Center, February 2nd, 1974, to celebrate the life of Keith Emerson, who unfortunately left us on March 11th, 2016. He committed suicide because he found that he couldn't use his incredibly talented hands anymore uh, the way he wanted to, to be a musician. And ended his life. Uh, before that, we heard some music from Golden Earring from January 2nd, 1977 at De Margal in Dronten, Netherlands. And that celebrates the life, the birthday of George Cunyan. And he's vocalist and guitarist for Golden Earring. He was born March 11th, 1948. And we started off the set with Welcome to My Nightmare, recorded June 17th, 1975 at the Inglewood Forum in California to celebrate the release of the album Welcome to My Nightmare on this day in 1975. If you like what you hear on the Past Lives podcast, please send me a comment, click the like button or subscribe, and we'll see you soon.